guys. I'm here in the Glenn Miller Ballroom, where this morning at 11 o'clock, Democratic Colorado Senator and U.S. Army veteran Raleigh Heath gave a speech to honor our veterans. In 1947, more than half of all college students were World War II veterans. This Veterans Day, the UMC is playing an important role as the university does its part to honor our veterans. Well, we, the University of Colorado Boulder's uh, University Memorial Center, we are the uh, official veterans uh, memorial for uh, any veteran from Colorado. So we feel that it's important for us to honor the memory of, uh, of, the, of those servicemen who have fallen, as well as the active uh, military and those veterans that's, that are still with us. Few students know that the UMC actually offers us the opportunity to honor veterans all year long. Uh, in 1976, we established the Veterans Lounge as part of the centennial celebration. Um, and we have had the artifacts, the bell, etc., the ship's wheel, and other items in there um, over the years. Though the number of students who enjoy veteran status has decreased following the end of World War II, student veterans still make up a large percentage of our college population. Uh, several hundred students are, are veterans, and that continues to grow as more um, um, people are released from the uh, from military service uh, after serving in Iraq and Afghanistan. In addition to today's ceremony, in recognition of their service to the country, veterans and their families are also eligible to purchase tickets for this Saturday's football game at the reduced price of only $5 a ticket. Our veterans are remembered and appreciated here at CU. Amanda Turner, News Team, Boulder.